Greetings and salutations. Welcome back. We're getting ready to hit this um this hard map or this hard world, hard difficulty, and uh, I'd just like to record these on OBS. I'm currently here. Um, let me get select this and then select this, and this is I'm gonna do some tutorial guides on how to uh, kind of maneuver through interfaces and how to read and understand them. But uh, I've been on the search for hard maps. Hard maps are actually kind of hard to come by, believe it or not. They're, uh, especially with planets, it's just one of those things where, um, for whatever reason, they're just not as, as plentiful as you would think they are. And sometimes they're even like the gravity. You always got to check the gravity before you enter on the planet because if it's above four, you have a high probability you're not getting off of it. Uh, and if you jump off a rock, you're going to break your leg. So, um, you know, I've been looking for planets that, that to set up on and, and to kind of set up habitation and It's one of those things where um, they're not they're not as easily to come by as you would think they are. Oh man, look how blue this thing is! They've really done a good job with the um, the seed and the voxel generation. And I'm gonna download Unity. I'm the kind of I'm kind of person who who. Um, you know, when I when I look at something and I realize that something doesn't feel right, then I try to figure out how to fix it. I feel like I, I, I start to look logically into uh, problem solving and solutions. And, um, you know, so and I'm, I'm realizing that there are a couple issues in the game that need to be addressed. And um like one of the things that drives me nuts is the view angles. I've talked about this in several videos. Man, I, I, I like this thing. It's a little excessive. It's a little oversized. I mean, for what it what it is. Um you know, but I, I look at all these thrusters, just the insanity. It's like super gluttony. It's very RP. And I had to rework if this is your first time tuning in, I had to rework the um the laser head because it was like let me put the shields on it was like completely uh not not efficient at all i had to here i'll kind of let me get lined up so i won't crash into the planet and then i'll show you like i spread out the laser to where it's like a six pack now it's you know three across and and you can kind of and then i stuck some lasers in there temporarily i mean some rocket turrets in there too also temporarily but I had to open it up, and you know, I, admittedly, it doesn't look the same. I mean, it's not as doesn't have as much swag or whatever. But um, what is this? We got a uh, communication center. Oh, let me see here. Let me see. Hold on. Let me. Let's look down. Those look like some pretty good POIs, to be honest. And what is this? A drone base. A communication center level six some of those runes you know unfortunately I you can tell early development they came up with a bunch of POIs just as fillers like those runes and you fly over there's a question mark and you fly over there and there's like two blocks and admittedly uh, you know and 30% of the world is filled with runes and it's kind of like one of those I'm not I don't know that for a fact but I'm just saying it's what it feels like at times and you have this these excessive POIs that exist that are kind of garbage, and they're I mean they're okay, but you know you go to planet after planet after planet and you encumber you encounter encumber you encounter um, a lot of POIs that are very lackluster, and I I get for the get the purpose of filler and game production. But a lot of them need to have kind of be gone back and refined, uh, crash, transport, rear, and just kind of refined a little bit and have uh, medium. That's good. Medium deposit. That's really good. The an issue that I've been having on a lot of these worlds. Let's check out the the deposits. Okay, one of twenty-seven, one of twelve, one of seven. 
you know, this could be this could be potentially really good if these deposits are more than um, small or very small. If they're smaller, a lot of planets I come to, the deposits are like small and very small. So it's it's very limited on um, kind of what what you can get out of it. I want to eat some food before I die. You you do not want to die in space on. I mean, in a uh, cockpit. There you go. I mean, I've been making rations. I've been focusing heavy on making rations because they don't expire. And I've had a bunch of issues with crops dying lately. Let's see what this is. This is probably like an, an extra large engine. You kind of run into, after a while, you kind of run into like scenarios. If, if you have something in the water, it's usually a cap, uh, crashed capital vessel. Um, you start to see kind of com commonality of these uh, POIs, and a lot of them they just need to be pulled. Unfortunately, they're 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 not really worth anything. To be honest, they'd be better off being a node. You know, like the runes, for example, that that are the um, ancient runes. Or there's nothing to salvage. There's no information. There's just like six concrete blocks. It's just a giant waste of time and resources to go check it out. Oh, this has got those little radi radiation zones. So, so far, my favorite planet is the swamp. One of the newer edition, a stem medium. There we go. What is this? Let's see what this is. I'm really, I'm supposed to be going towards enemy targets. And I'm, uh, what is this? Submerged tank? Meh. That's okay. You get a lot of you get a lot of steel out of a smirch tank. Um, let's see what this is. We're gonna go here. Unfortunately, the kind of the bad thing about some of these uh, level six, level eight, level eight communication center. That's probably a pretty pretty good POI. What is this? What we got here? We got. Uh, I bet you that's a good resource because it's got drone protection. Cozamine, medium. That's what's up. If there's if there's medium deposits, usually level four, level six. Let's see here. Yeah, this doesn't look like this looks like a fairly fairly decent planet. You know, um, it's got medium sp spawn density. Let's see what this is. This could be a settlement. what we'll do is we'll we'll uh we'll we'll get this this poi i'll stop the video and then we'll go what is that the small iron meh 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 we'll uh we'll we'll pop up and then we'll go check out some more planets because based off the level of uh of this stuff up here like I'm surprised I didn't see see a POI there's a POI in here somewhere in order for that to be red I didn't see it though like there's this should be turning red here pretty soon too let's see let's get this real quick and the reason why I share a lot of this gameplay you know I don't monetize I don't I don't try to monetize I'm not in the YouTube game it pisses me off like when I see a lot of YouTubers um, they're 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 in it for the the monetary thing. They're making all these videos because they believe that's where the money advance spaceport. Ooh, look look let's look at this. Ooh, that actually looks interesting. I've never encountered that one before. Ooh, look at this look at this mining barge. Man, whoever did this did a fantastic job. Fantastic job. Okay, we'll uh, we'll go get this one. I know we said we were gonna leave, but I want to go see what level eight is. That's haven't seen anything higher than level nine. I think ten is the highest. So we'll um, yeah, we'll go check this out, and we'll see what this is at. And you can see there's a bunch that's undiscovered. So 
I think this would be a good place. I think this this constellation is better than the previous one. Maybe I'm saying that right. Is it galaxy? Galaxy constellation? There's constellations in a galaxy? Or are there systems in a galaxy? God, I'm so space ignorant. Let me see. So, space, sectors. Okay. This sector, planets, sectors, and I think this is the galaxy. So, so... What is this? Factory. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, it's shooting at me. I want to see what the factory looks like. Oh. Yeah, that looks good. That looks really good. You can see the CPU bumped up. When I was backing up like that, look at that. CPU 82, 85, 94. Like, there is a reason... There is, when I back up, there is something that goes on there, right? And so if I press, let me press laser, 92. There, when I do W and back key, 89, 99. So if I press, all right there, that's the highest backwards. And there's something going on there. Forward, backwards, 91. Nine, maybe if I press the up key at the same time, let me go forward. Oh, there it is. A, A, and so there is a reason to exceed the two generators on this, but it's only, it's only in this scenario. So there is a reason to run potentially three, but most of the time you get away with two. Yeah, because once you hit out, once you hit space, all of a sudden, your your generation consumption just drops down to nothing. Like, it goes from the 80s and 90s down to 10 and 5. So, its, it's sub-requirement is... Um, so, this is... We're in a PvP. Right now, we're in... This is PvP. This is PvP. 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 PvE. PvE, right there. So there's that one. There's more than one. There's all of these are okay. So we gotta do a little math here. So this is PvP, PvP, PvE. Okay, so we're gonna go here. Uh PvE. Oh, there's a bunch of good mats there. Wow, there's a lot. Look at threes, three. So three magnesium, three iron, three cobalt, and two asterium. And that is so close to the sun. Um, PvP, PvE. So I could put a base here. I could put a base here. Okay, so this is the outer ring. I put a base here. Which is closer. So my options are these planets, and these all share these all share different. Um, let's see. Let me see something. Let me select this. Let's see what these if these planets are inhabitable. So PVB planet, PVE planets. Well, wow, that looks like a good one right there. Moon one. What's the what's the galaxy look like? These these share the same galaxy? No, they don't. They're all different galaxies. Um, interesting, interesting. But these are all PVE galaxies. There's gold there, and then this one. kind of prefer this one right here to be honest uh what's this planet look like Ooh, high gravity Ooh. Ooh. pvp pvp pve oh that's why we went there it's because that was a pve planet 
So we're gonna go. We're gonna go. So it's a PVP planet, but it's a PVP PVE. Okay, we're gonna go there. We're gonna go there. We're gonna go check that out. That's where we're going next. All right, I'm stopping the video here. Stay tuned. Follow follow on the next channel.